on UPC, more drinking and driving. I'll let you know what went on yesterday. No. And even more senior information than you've ever imagined. All this and more is coming up on UPC, and it starts right now. Second edition of the UPC Morning Show. I'm Beth Masters. And I'm Amy Butler. All National Honor Society members, there will be a meeting for all junior members today, Thursday the 22nd. Those of you making speeches now have until today to prepare your speeches. All juniors, please attend at 2.05 in the Media Center. The meeting May 15th has been canceled due to AP testing. Prom tickets are now on sale this week in the alcove near the front office. They will be sold for $25 each, $50 a couple. The last day for ticket sales is Friday, and remember, no tickets will be sold at the door. Don't get left out, and a night you'll never forget. Ms. Lambeth is here to talk about the end of the year wrap-up information. Here's Diane with more. Hi, I'm here with Lambeth this morning. Um, what information do you have for us? Good morning, Diane. I guess I really don't have information as much as I uh, have some thank yous to the student body. I feel like this has just been a very good school year. Uh, the student body is just uh, above and beyond the other schools in, in all of Pinellas County or even the state of Florida. So I've just been very pleased this year, and this is a big thank you to the student body from me for your cooperation and just for a good school year. I would like to mention a couple of things though. I know Mr. Palmer was on yesterday talking about the zero tolerance policy. And just a reminder to all students, if you're going to the prom this Saturday night, we want you to have a super time. All the other events that are coming up, we want you to have a great time. But we also do need to remind you of the zero tolerance policy and other school policies that are so important for everyone to remember. And on a uh, final note, I would like to thank the seniors. You've had a super year along, as I said, with the rest of the student body. And remind seniors that um, I will be coming into some of your classes next week. I think I've arranged to come into the English classes to talk with, with all the seniors about graduation and giving them some information. So I look forward to that. It's going to be quite a round robin next week getting around to all the classes. But again, student body, thank you so much for a good year. Uh, just again, a little ca caution to the wind. Uh, keep in mind school policy as you attend these different events and have a great day. Thanks. Back to you guys. Hope everyone has a great end of the year. Thank you, Miss Lambeth. The music department presents its band and chorus in their final concert of the year along with Safety Harbor Middle School Band Thursday, May 22nd in the Countryside Auditorium at 7 o'clock. Admission is free, so come out and enjoy an evening of music. The Laureate is here. Copies will be sold in front of the Media Center before school and at lunches. Pre-sale copies are in L8 or L9. Copies are limited, so don't wait. The members at large have been chosen. If you apply, the list is posted outside of Miss Lil's room B4. Come to the school picnic at Felipe Park in Safety Harbor on Friday, May 23rd at 4 o'clock to 8 o'clock. All grades, parents, and students are welcome and no cost. At the at the event of and the event of the evening is still worth taking a pie in the face by one lucky student. So come out this Friday for lots of fun in Shelter 7 and 1. Yesterday we announced that UPC had won, for, had won awards for the productions of two commercials promoting the consequences of drinking and driving. Today we have the second commercial by Dory Reitmeyer, Amy Butler, and myself. It's so hard to say goodbye to yesterday. Drinking and driving is a deadly mix. It's killing the youth of tomorrow. Together we won third place and a $100 prize for our TV production program. A special senior assembly will be held next Tuesday morning in the auditorium during an extended homeroom. Seniors should report directly to the auditorium. This assembly will include rehearsal for the commencement ceremony and other information for graduation day. Tomorrow is Beach Bum Day. Wear your cutoffs and just be comfortable. Show your school spirit and come dressed as a beach bum. Seniors, yearbooks will be distributed at senior breakfast. 
you will have the opportunity to purchase a yearbook at Senior Breakfast if you did not pre-order for $60 cash. After Senior Breakfast, anyone who turned in photos for the slideshow may pick them up in Ms. Sorello O'Donnell's room, L3. As you know, the Powder Puff game was played last night. With the highlights, here's Alfredo with sports. Thank you, Amy and Beth. I'm Alfredo Muente with UPC Sports. Well, there was no score in the first half of last night's Powder Puff game, but this second half reception by number nine, Kelly Blagy, set up a 23-yard field goal by Jamie Thiel, which gave him a 3-0 lead. It was the seniors' game yesterday, though, as Candace Hayes scored this touchdown to give them a 6-3 lead. This late break by Thiel had a chance to win it, but the juniors ran out of time, and the seniors won by the final of 6-3. Also, the Garnet and Gold game that was played afterwards was won by the Garnet team 16 to nothing. Congratulations to both winning squads. In other news, all softball players need to let Coach Kitchen know today how many parents will be coming to the awards picnic. And finally, the football team will not have practice, meetings, or, works out, or workout today. Enjoy your day off. That's all from here. Now back to Amy and Beth. Thank you, Alfredo. And Beth, what's on the UPC calendar? Let's take a look. All Earth Effects members interested in running for an office for the 97-98 school year, stop by room E3 today for a nomination form. You must attend the meeting to be held Thursday, May 22nd if you want to run. <laughs> Attention All Earth Effects members, there will be an end of the year ice cream social held on Thursday, May 22nd after school in room E2. Come and nominate your future officers and enjoy a Sunday. All National Honor Society and Interact Club tutors are invited to room E1 today during lunch for cake and ice cream. If you are a volunteer tutor on Tuesday and Thursday after school, please come and enjoy dessert. Compliments of our volunteer program and Ms. Huser. There will be an SGA meeting on Tuesday, May 27th. Homecoming theme will be chosen. Please come to the meeting with ideas for the homecoming theme. And also, any student interested in becoming a member of the Flag Corps or Guard for the coming marching season, please sign up in the band room sometime this week. For Spirit Week, the days that we have left are going to be today is Class Color Day with freshmen yellow, sophomores red, juniors white, and seniors black. Tomorrow will be Beach Day. And, and also, we have a few more announcements about the senior breakfast. Today, you need to be at... The uh, double tree tomorrow, it's at 745. Try to carpool if you can. Bring change for meters if you're going to be running late. Dress is dressy casual. You can buy video yearbooks for $12 and order them then, or yearbooks will be distributed and sold for, uh, for $60. And we're done for today. Okay, we hope you have a great day. We have Powder Puff to end the show with. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Pushing, pulling, trying to break free. Pushing, pulling, trying to break free. Oh, pushing, pulling, trying to break free. Pushing, pulling, trying to break free. Pushing, pulling, trying to break free. Pushing, pulling, trying to break. Pushing, pulling, trying to break free. I guess I'm on the ground, baby.